Hey everyone, and welcome to episode 6 of The Sims Barbie Legacy. We're basically picking up right where we left off. Um, okay. We need to... You and your phone. You have started the you and your phone quest. Okay, she needs to get some food. I'm just let her do that. What is this? Where you'll learn about the phone menu and the many different ways it's used. Complete this discovery quest to earn simoleons. I mean, I'm not gonna turn down money, so we're definitely gonna do that. I don't think you're able to see the quest, but what we need to do is open the phone, order pizza, and take a photo with your phone. So, oh my gosh, there's still so much mess from the land grabs being here. Um, let's see, and we need to repair the toilet. If you hear any noise, it's my husband in the background opening a package that he's very excited about. Um, Uh, so, we're gonna focus on, uh, basically ending up with Santa. I think we've dedicated, uh, the whole Santa storyline. Um, and also I want to give a shout out to one of the comments, uh, by Sensational Virgo. Uh, they pointed out that if we get with Santa, it's literally gonna be like Mrs. Claus because she does baking and we're just gonna make cookies all day. And I love that storyline. So we're definitely going with that. Also, Sensational Virgo, uh, singing... Slinging hammers and nails left and right is not Paris's cup of tea. Should Paris banish this self-abuse and admit she dislikes hand handiness? You know what? We're going to say it. She dislikes it. So, yes. Um, but I wanted to get back to this comment. Um, she, not she, uh, this person, Sensational Virgo, they also said, da da da, da. Oh, we should visit the land grabs and borrow money from each person and then take over the book club from Nancy. I don't know about taking over the book club from Nancy. I want like a progression with the book club, but I do think we're gonna visit the land grabs and give them back some chaos if at the very least, um, at the very least, but we're also gonna try to get money out, out of them too. Okay, but first we need to get our actual house in order. So yeah, we, we need to clean up our house before, oh my gosh. My boss is calling, should I pick it up? Okay. Am I gonna get fired? I forgot she was supposed to go to work. Paris is missing work. If she misses too many days off her job, oh my God. Go to work, go to work, girl. I forgot I left the game with her needing to go to work. Oh my gosh, she's gonna get fired. Oh, actually there's something I need to show all of you. Turn on lights, this room. Um, so for the first time ever, I have created custom content. I have been playing The Sims since Sims 1 and I've never created custom content. I spent one day, way longer than I should have, and I created my first piece of custom content. I'm so proud of it. Um, and I created it for this legacy. I think it's so perfect. And here it is right here. So as you can see, this is stereotypical housewife Barbie. I literally made a Barbie of our Barbie Sim. This is one of her outfits. Like I can literally change her into it. So as you can see, uh -huh. this is one of her outfits, one of my favorite outfits, and it's hot, like big time referencing an outfit from the Barbie movie, if you've seen it. And here is the doll of this outfit. Now, if you wanna know how I did this, honestly, I couldn't even tell you. It took hours. Basically, I made a deco sim, which is a thing people do for photos, apparently. Um, but like I made a deco sim and then I replaced it with an action figure object. Then I had to shrink the size of it. But in the end, I ended up with literally a Barbie. I was able to put my um, own like description, everything. It's like the fully articulated Barbie is a replica of Paris Barbie, the generation one heir of the Barbie legacy. So I think from now on what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna have to teach myself to do it all over again if I'm honest but I'm gonna try making a Barbie of every Sim because in most legacies they have like paintings of each heir or like um, they, they have like a way of representing their heirs as time goes on. So I'm gonna have a Barbie of each heir. So yeah, and I literally have this as a piece of custom content. Like if I go into the children's room, look, there she is right there. Oh, and this is what she looks like when I first get her. So it's literally like a replica of her and I have to like size her down and shrink her. And then she's doll size and she's literally in the kids toy section and everything, it is so cool. So 
I'm very proud of myself because it was so much work. It's also, I love that the first custom content I ever made is a doll in the game. So I'm very, very, very proud of myself. It's so cool. But anyway, all right, we need to, let's use our phone to do these other things. They said take a photo. Let's take a selfie. Who is that? Barbie. We just got through people doing that all the time. And now you're going to do it. What? No, no. What? What? This is not what I wanted. Take a photo. I did not want that angle of Barbie. Take a selfie. Oh, she is very angry. You know what? We could change her emotion. Let's see what else we come up with. Oh, she is very angry. You know what? We're, we're going to capture this moment. Beautiful. Okay, that should... Chat with a sim or play a game. So now let's... I'm trying to do this thing so we can actually do it. Let's order a pizza. Order a delivery. It's right under there. And look, pizza delivery. Let's get a... Ooh, the kebab pizza looks delicious. Let's order a kebab pizza. She needs to pick this up. She also has a trash plant. Okay. You need to clean up the trash. We need to calm her down. She is so angry. We need to get rid of this plant. We do not need a trash plant. Though it actually looks kind of cute right now. Oh my gosh. Oh, also I wanted to give credit again. Okay, one of my past videos, I had, um, oh, I don't know how to put this together. I believe it's Phoebe, De Phoebe DeMonte Falcon 1423. They commented how the correct way to say this character's name, I mispronounced it before, it's Koichi. So this is Koichi um the mailman that she kind of had a crush on but we're, we're pursuing santa claus now um quick question eliza pancakes and i were planning to spend some casual friend time together should i do it you know what go for it go for eliza i mean eliza's not really my cup of tea but you know live your best life wait who just showed up at my front door oh it's the pizza delivery guy take pizza i need you to i need you to stop with the trash girl even though your house is very bad. She's going through it. Okay, I really was planning to go to Land Grab's house, but it's taking all day just to clean her house. Stop. Girl, get the pizza. This guy needs to go to his job. And she's just gonna dump trash. Cool. Uh. Okay. Well, she got a pizza. I don't know. I don't know if I've ever even ordered a pizza in The Sims 4. I should do it more often just to make things easier. Okay, now let's get back into cleaning up this house because it's so bad. Oh, did we get any photos? Did those come out good? Let's see. Did I not pay him? I was supposed to pay him. My bad. Here's your pizza, that'll be $25. I forgot to pay the guy. She's mad at the... Keep cleaning up, girl. You're not done. We'll sell the rest, that one looks great. Look at that, beautiful. Let's frame it. Is there a pink one? Red, silver, dark wood, black. We'll just do white. It's fine. Why isn't she cleaning that up? What is she doing? Is my sink broken? Does this sink not work for washing dishes? No, it does. Is it not set as a... It's set as a kitchen sink. I don't know why she's not washing it. What is going on?
Is she actually gonna wash it now? No, she's just gonna throw it away. Okay, see, she's washing dishes now. I don't know what the problem was before. Now you can have a slice of pizza. Oh, she already grabbed it. It doesn't show when you pick up a slice like it did in the... I'm pretty sure in Sims 2 you could literally see them take each slice. Okay. She's doing better now. She's still a little tense. Why? Stressful from work. She still hasn't gotten promoted. That's insane to me. I mean, I know I still need to record the baking videos, but I just don't have the money to buy the whole setup. Okay, so you might be thinking right now, Greg, the frame totally changed. Greg, you're in a new outfit. What happened? And I'm going to explain all those things. Basically, the worst thing possible in the world happened. I wasn't recording for such a long span of time. And on top of that long, it being a long span of time, so much happened and I'm so upset that it did not record. So now I have to like catch you guys up on so much. Okay, for starters, you can see Santa here. Yeah, we're not gonna even talk about that at the moment. So last we left, you know, she was eating pizza right here. And then what happened, I was like, oh, you know what, let's invent, uh, we found out we were off for the uh, work for the next three days, now two days, because as you can see, it's 9 p.m. on Saturday. Um, I was like, let's invite Santa over for the weekend. So I went over and I invited him over. I don't even think it's gonna show it here. I'd have to click on a new person. But you can invite over for the weekend. Where is it? Okay, it's over there somewhere. I invited him over for the weekend. And I was like, great, he can come over for the weekend. We'll have a good weekend chat. So he came over and then I was like, oh, you know what Barbie should do? She should make drinks and cookies. That would be so cute. And they can just have like a little coupley time staying in because she keeps getting angry about how hot it is outside. So I won't make them go anywhere. And look. She made her favorite type of drink, the Cupid juice. She drank hers, Santa did not drink his. And she made cookies. I'll even open the fridge to prove to you guys that I'm not making any of this up. Look, right there, decorated sugar cookies made by Paris Barbie. So our wonderful, wonderful Paris Barbie, she like made cookies and drinks, he came over and they were cooking the cookies together actually because you can get someone to join cooking. And then something crazy happened. Santa asked to move in and I was shook. I didn't know what to do. I was talking to the camera that apparently was not recording. And I was trying to think of what really works for like their dynamic. And I was like, okay, I feel like Paris Barbie, she's our housewife Barbie. I feel like she'd wanna follow the steps. Like she'd want to like date and then get engaged and then move like move in and marry and all that stuff you know like kind of follow like the traditional um steps that people used to follow way back when um i was like i feel like that just like the traditional kind of style really matches up with housewife barbie the way they described her so i decided that's what we're gonna do so i said no to him moving in i was like she'd want to be engaged at least first and so oh also we found out that uh santa is bisexual love that for him um, so right here, residency rejection. So he got upset that, um, he wasn't allowed in. Did Paris let down Clement by not agreeing to let them move in together? And he felt they weren't close enough because he thought, you know, so like that proves that that was a thing, you know, he asked to move in. She said, no, I was like, we'd want to, she wants to follow the traditional steps. Well, tell me why only a couple minutes later i think they like woohooed once i was like they haven't done that yet let's have the first time blah 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 you know and then he proposed like he proposed to paris and i was shook i didn't know what to do i didn't know if i wanted to say yes or not but i was like i literally just said she'd want to follow the classic steps of like oh i didn't even tell you guys they became boyfriend and girlfriend like when he came over and then they started making cookies together we're going so fast but then he proposed like santa proposed to paris one i was sad because it didn't do the whole animation of him getting down on one knee i thought that would have been really cute but then it asked me if she, paris wanted to accept or not and i was like i said she want to follow the steps and she didn't want him to move in because they weren't like engaged at least first and he proposed 
So now they're engaged. You can see that right there. I even gave her a little ring. Can you see it? Let's see. Yeah, right there. It's like uh, white and pink. It's with the wedding pack. There you go. It's like white and pink. It's really cute. Um, it doesn't go with all of her outfits, but it does go with her current outfit. Um, so then they became engaged. And then Santa started playing with the Barbie of Paris Barbie. And that's why she's over here now, because he was playing with her and pulled her off of the mantle. Um, I did find out, though, when you the Sim puts it in their inventory, like, okay, let me show you. So it's in the toy aisle, and when you place it, because it's a deco Sim, it's huge. So you have to scale it down, but it scales it back up if a Sim puts it in their inventory. So that's a thing. But, you know, that's fine. That's a, another thing to deal with. Maybe the mod isn't perfect, but still, I'm very proud of my little Barbie sim. Um, but yeah, so that's basically everything you missed. They're engaged. Uh, try for baby. Okay, we're not doing that yet, but we'll like keep it there. Um, and when I realized I wasn't recording, I was talking about maybe we'll do the wedding here in this backyard area. Like maybe we'll make it a little bit bigger, extended or something, and have him move in and we can just do after the wedding, I think but have the wedding here in the backyard and we can invite all their friends and stuff. Um, so we're just gonna continue here. They're literally just having a good time. Like, look, we have engaged, we have feeling close connection, deep connection, flattered. Um, interesting flick, they watched a movie. Oh, she's sobering up from her drink she had. Look, it's doing the little heart. I love that she was able to make her favorite drink. Um, and then of course, you know, she's a little drunk. So yeah, these two are just, thanks to their compatible personality, Paris Barbie formed a positive impression towards Clement. This will help build a harmonious relationship. That's nice. But yeah, so these two are just having a great time. They are engaged now. I cannot believe I was not recording during that. I am so upset. Like, I, that's why it's a new day. Um, I fully just walked away. I was like, I'm done for the night. I missed that whole thing. I'm just done. So I walked away for the night, but I'm back, which is also why this video is probably going to be up late. Is he sleeping on the couch? Oh my gosh. You can come to bed. Oh, I also found out that they cannot woohoo in this bed together. Um, apparently something with the way it's shaped or something. I don't know. But yeah. Oh, oh, she's going to go clean up the drink. I was like, is she about to have another? But yes. Paris Barbie, she's very happy. She's having a good time. She's engaged now, which is exciting. But I need to get a better sink in here. Actually, now that we have $2,000. Did you guys see me get to $2,000? I don't even remember how I got it. She's going to go to bed now. Um, I think I don't even know what to do tomorrow. Can he even share the bed with her? I don't know. We might end up losing this bed. Where did he go? Santa? Clement? He's staying with her. Well, oh, that's right. The land grabs used to leave all the time, so that's actually not that weird. Okay, we're in Tartosa. Um, this is a beautiful area, honestly. Uh, I checked out the shops. It looks like they're closed until 9 a.m. So we're here a little early. It's like 7.48, but it's fine. We're going to be here when they open, but it's a cute little area. I think our outfit's actually really nice for the area. But I gotta check out some of the shops and just kind of hang out with uh, Clement today, I guess. Her outfit really is perfect for this area. What can we do? You know what? Let's practice singing. Why not? Uh, sure, she can like singing. But let's see. We have a couple different shops, right? We have... Oh, we have the cake shop here. We have this that looks like a floral shop. Oh, here's a dress shop? Koichi. Eliza Pancakes and I had a blast together. Thank you for your advice. Oh, nice. We can do some window shopping. Is that it? Just those three shops? It looks like he's about to start work. Uh, nice. 
By wedding bouquet. Moscova. I'll let her. <laughs> I'll, I'll fast forward until 9 o'clock. Okay. We're done with your singing. Oh, Barbie. Please stop. Please stop. Alright. Let's check out some of this wedding stuff we can do. Let's look at a wedding bouquet. Black rose, blue rose, blush rose bouquet. That could be pretty good. Uh, blush rose, delicate bouquet. Colorful daisy, colorful daisy, delicate. Blue rose, pastel garden flower bouquet. Oh, that sounds nice. Oh, pink rose, that sounds really nice. Very expensive. Red rose, white rose, white rose, delicate. Um, I think I want to go, let's go with the pink rose, delicate, right? Like, that sounds like really nice. What else can we do? Oh, I could have haggled. We can buy flowers too. Oh no. Oh no. I could have haggled. I should have haggled. Plan formal outfits. That's all you can do. Okay, now we have the cake shop. Purchase what? Let's haggle first and see if we can get a good price. I mean, I actually. I'm not gonna lie, I'd planned on her baking her own wedding cake. That was the plan, at least. But also, it's a little... Oh, is this another shop over here? <gasps> what is this? Oh, it's just a food shop. You drive a hard bargain, tell you what. I'll give you 25% off anything at this table. Nice! So she got a uh, thing. Buy discounted item. Oh, she got a discount. I feel like I want to do it. How long do they last for? Because what if I buy one and then it goes bad? <gasps> heart wedding. That one's heart wedding too, but this one's all pink. Rosy two-tiered heart cake. Rosy and white two-tiered heart cake. Hexagon. Eh, that looks a little too modern. Round off. Okay, I think I might actually go with one of these for her wedding cake because I don't think she's going to be able to to be this level. I think this one's, the, one of these two are the nicest. I think I like this one. Let me see how long we have. In her inventory. Please have a long time on it. One day. Is it going to be better if I put it in the... Is it going to be better if I um, put it in the fridge? I'm gonna be so sad. Oh, what did she get with him? Uh, ah, friendly advice, nice. Oh, one of the other things I forgot to tell you guys, um, I went to the land grab, grab's house and basically ended up fighting with Malcolm and then Nancy and Paris got to a huge, like screaming match at each other. So their relationship is actually worse now. So we definitely wanna do a book club takeover. And now, we need to get rid of Nancy and Susan. But I feel like we need to build some allies first. So we need to work on that as well. Actually, maybe we'll do a book club hangout today. So we bought a cake, which is fun. The problem is it might go bad before the wedding because there's no way. You know what? Let's look at the calendar. Let's get married next Saturday. I feel like that's fair. Um, let's add an <gasps> Add wedding event. Okay. Wedding ceremony. Rehearsal dinner. Reception. Family gathering. Bachelorette party. Engagement dinner. Oh, should we do an engagement dinner? Because we just had an engagement. But I don't have a lot of money. Um, Let's go with the... We could do a bachelorette party with the book club members. That could be kind of fun. So how about this? Friday, we'll do a bachelorette party. And then Saturday, what's today? Sunday. No, this. Ooh, I almost did that way too late. So Friday, we could do, what days, what, 
what days is her schedule? She works Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Okay, so let's look at the schedule. I think Friday we will do a read fair flyer. Oh, that's cute. Um, at a wedding event, we will have a rehearsal dinner. I don't think we need a rehearsal dinner. I think we'll just do a bachelorette party with the book club. Um, invite a sim. We need her club. Clubs. All right, so we'll have... <gasps> we can invite everybody. Except, like, everybody that's in her club, except for, um, you know, that one girl we hate, Susan. We'll even invite Nancy. We don't even like Nancy, but we'll invite Nancy. Oh, she doesn't even show up here. <gasps> we have to invite Kochi. Why not? He can be, he can hang with the girls. I like that. That's a good squad. So we have Kochi, we have Elizabeth, Clara, Lily, Katrina, and Nancy. We're inviting Nancy for the drama. You know, keep your friends close, your enemies closer. Um, let's pick location. We need to do it at a bar. Um, let's go for 8 p.m. Uh, this is the bar they met at, but I don't know. I don't think I'm feeling Oasis Springs. San Mashuno. Now, that could be fun. Uh, the lounge at the top, but it could be cold. So we should do it somewhere inside. A karaoke bar, that could be pretty cool. A karaoke bar. Um, I don't think Mount Com Komarebi. I don't think Sulani. Newcrest, that is our house. Tartosa. Oh, they have a lounge in Tartosa. Glimmer book. You know what? I feel karaoke bar is good. Um, available activities. Uh, desserts. Drinks dancing, and toast. Uh, do I need an entertainer? How much is it? Did it say? 250? Okay, no, we don't need that. And it's a karaoke bar, so I think they'll already have a mixologist, right? Um, dancing, toast, drinks, desserts. You know what, we're gonna take away desserts. We're just gonna do drinks, dancing, and toast. And it's gonna be, wait, I thought I already chose where. In San Mashuno, the karaoke bar. Honey pop, yeah. Okay, now let's plan our wedding event. Let's do a wedding ceremony. Um, bride or groom, okay, nice. <gasps> Sim of Honor? Wait. I have to ask someone to be my Sim of Honor. And an officiant? A flower pal, a ring bearer? <gasps> There's so much I still need to do. Sprouse. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Okay. <gasps> and I can edit their outfit. Wait, I already bought a wedding cake. Dress code, color. Polished in pink. <gasps> this is amazing. Okay, so we still need to do some things. Like, so now we're organizing for the wedding. That's basically what we're working on. So... Actually, we have a lot of things to do. I feel like we need to have a book club outing so we can get closer with our friends. So let's do that randomly in the middle of the day. Start gathering. Gather at lounge. So, sorry for deserting Clement. We had a good little time. We'll see him later at the house because he's staying over. But I feel like we need to make some friends. We need a maid of honor or person of honor, which could be Koichi. That's kind of her closest friend other than Clement. 
All right. So let's, uh, <gasps> efficient flower pal. Look, so I can do all this. So I need to like start making some more friends. Wait, no, I don't want her drinking because she gets, she's a sad drunk. All these people, except for <laughs> Susan, will be at the wedding. We do not like Susan. Stop trying to drink. She's gonna have a drink. You're fun to be around. She likes us. Oh my gosh. Oh, she's excited for our wedding. I wonder if we could go ahead and ask her to be like maid of honor. I feel like that would be flower pal. Maybe they're not close enough yet. Oh no, we're drunk. Has to be sim of honor. There we go. I need that spot filled. Ah, oh, great! She's gonna be our sim of honor. I love that. You know what I dislike about Susan? We don't like her, but also she's so fabulous and she's so beautiful. She could have been a great ally. Oh, we have like drunk... We have like drunk options. This is really cool. What if we ask Koichi to be our officiant? That could be kind of cool. You know what? Let's invite him over. Hang out current a lot. There he is. When he gets up here, um, we'll ask him to be the officiant. I think that'd be pretty cool. Wait, is that weird? Because they had an almost romance thing. I think it's fine. He's also like her best friend. Flower pal. Confident. There we go. Let's go. Affection. Isn't there hug? <gasps> yeah, hug. I feel like he's her best friend. Well, he literally is her closest friend. Boy. <laughs> Let's ask him to be officiant. Her mailman becomes her officiant. Oh my gosh. That's amazing. So now we have officiant and a maid of honor. The thing we're missing is a flower pal, but I think that's okay if we don't have one. Oh, they're good friends now. Paris can't wait to tell everyone about her engagement. It's her favorite topic conversation because she just can't keep it inside anymore. Now on to the planning. Oh, that's so cute that she's so excited for her wedding. So I feel like we have definitely upped our relationships quite a bit. That's what the focus was. We also made a friend, Janae, who I didn't really, you know, know about. Their acquaintance, but, you know, could be a friend. But now we're getting hungry and everything, so I think it's okay to go. I think it's okay for us to head home. We had a good outing. Where did she get cake? <gasps> that was a piece of the wedding cake. She was hungry and she just pulled out. Oh no. I was gonna save that. Nobody is coming home with her. Nobody. Okay, we're back home and Clement's actually here. Let's go and serve dinner. What do we wanna do? Uh, let's do fried chicken sliders. Koichi. Hey, Paris. I think Agnetha Cumberbatch is pretty cute. Should I ask her out? You know what? Go for it. That's an interesting one. So, let's look at this cake once she gets into this room, but I think she literally just took a piece out of it. Okay, let's see. Okay, it didn't remove a piece from the cake. Now, I want to see if I put it in the fridge, will it last longer? Let's do open. 21 days. Okay, so this can still be their wedding cake if they don't use it. But I need to, like, stop them from grabbing it, which is not easy. Oh, he's angry, and she's tense from sobering up. 
to Noba. Oh. Oh my gosh, he was, did, was surprised by her language. Let's do this. Invite to join cooking. Romance. Compliment appearance. Oh my gosh. If we can get her calm down. Maybe if she, we can get her flirting, she'll calm down. I think he's, do, he's feeling a little sad. Can I not call Tamil? Why is he mad about the trash he put on the ground? Oh no. Uh huh. Oh, he's just gonna sit with her while she eats. He seems sad. Oh, apologize. She upset him. Aw. We can give him rev residence key so he can come by whenever he wants. Elope and plan wedding event. We're not doing either of us. And we can do Brighton Day too. Oh, she's feeling better, but it doesn't look like he is. Poor guy. I think he's still a little sad from the sentiment of her not letting him move in. But don't worry, you'll get to move in very soon. Oh, she's back to feeling tense. That did not last long. Is that going to shock him again? Santa does not like her speaking bad language. All right, I think it's time for her to go to bed. We're going to get her to throw that away and shower. Yeah, take bath, and then she can go to sleep. Because it looks like she is kind of going through it at the moment, and Clement is shook by the words coming out of her mouth. But I think that's good enough to end this here. Um, yeah, I guess things are kind of crazy. Look, this happens all the time. Do you see how it's turning blue? And like, look, this is blue now, but it's fully supposed to be white. I don't know what the deal with that is. Like, look, it's literally, I don't know. I don't know what's going on there. Um, anyway, so I guess that's the end of this video. I feel really bad that so much of it is missing, but that's why I decided to go a little further with this episode, I guess. Um, we had a little hangout. We started getting closer with some of our friends. I think I want to do some more friends hangouts because I want her to be really close um, to like Elizabeth since she's going to be the maid of honor. Um, Koichi, we're already really close to. He's going to be our officiant. I think that's going to be really cute. Um, I think Janae, we have good compatibility. We just met her at the bar while we were drunk, so that's kind of cool. Um, and maybe Katrina, we have good compatibility. We need to get more with Lily and Clara. Um, I really want the book club girls to be there, everyone but Susan, of course, because we don't like Susan. Um, we're, I think we're still going to invite Nancy because she's, like, the leader of the book club, you know. We want to keep her close until we, like, usurp her. But, yeah, I think that's pretty good. Um, spinning, look, look, look. This is what I was talking about. Look, he can play with her like a doll. It's not perfect, but it's pretty good, you know? Oh, my gosh. But, um, yeah, so that was a pretty good one. We have our wedding cake as long as they don't break into it, which kind of cool. Um, we also have our... Um, can we pull that out? Ah, oh, this is the bouquet. It's beautiful. And I'm going to get a nice little wedding outfit for Barbie. Um, I'm really excited about that. I'm going to pause it right here and save, actually. But, yeah, that's about everything. I hope you all enjoyed this one. I really feel bad that you guys missed the engagement and him asking to move in and stuff. But, honestly, I didn't mean to. I would have included it if I could, but I messed up with the recording. But it's fine. 
Um, that's about it for this part. I'm really excited. I think this next few parts is going to be gearing up for the wedding and getting that together. Um, I do like the idea of throwing the wedding party here. We'll have the bachelorette party coming up. Yeah, I'm really excited for everything. So that's it in this part. Um, so in the comments, let me know what you think about this coming together. Is there anything you would love to see at the wedding? Let me know. Um, as always, my socials will be tagged down below if you're interested in any of that. And I guess I'll see you on the next one. Bye.